All right, guys, so I'll get to right to the point. So we're streaming uh, from Android smartphone to an external HDMI connected monitor, content protected movies, shows that um, is uh, DHCP protected and using the splitter to do it. So I'll play that real fast so you guys can see it. This is the grandparents are. Oh, here it is. I can picture every one of them. And it's coming out of uh, my Galaxy phone here, so so we'll uh, we'll bring that back down, and I'll show you how this is done. So what I did is I did a bunch of research, found this splitter here. I'll leave a link to it in the description below. I bought it off Amazon. Here's the actual splitter here. It does a DHCP 2.0. Has two outputs and one input in the back. The uh, HDMI. Um, inputs and outputs and one uh, 5 volt AC power adapter that you plug into your you know power strip or whatever um, and that allows you to basically connect your smartphone to an external monitor I have a Galaxy S21 Ultra I don't know if all the Galaxy phones do this but they have this app built in that's uh, called DeX and when you have that enabled and a uh, external HDMI monitor connected to it uh, it creates a desktop experience, so it actually looks like a desktop here, uh, Windows desktop. So it's not mirroring, these are two different screens, so it's not a mirrored screen like the uh, Google Pixel phones. So I'll show you how this is connected. I got a USB-C connect, uh, cable connected here. The other end of this cable is this right here, which is a HDMI. So HDMI in and then two HDMI cables out. They're full size, normal size cables. So this does 4K HDCP 2.0. Yeah, officially they say that they do not strip the HDCP uh, protection out of the stream, but it actually does. So that's pretty awesome. So yeah, my phone connected to the output in the back. Uh, or the input in the back, the middle connection, and then the output goes from from here, another HDMI cable, and that goes all the way around to to the back side of my my 4K monitor here. So I'm able to watch stuff on here uh, that is content protected. So that's the gist of it. I'm gonna do a, another video where I test this out with the uh, Pixel 6 phones. Or sorry, I sold the uh, Pixel 6. It'll be the Pixel 3 that I have. I'll test it with Pixel 3, see how that does. Um, but right now I cannot do that because I do not have the HDMI cable, the extra one, to uh, connect everything together. So just so you know, I did test that video out, um, that chicken people video, without this adapter just to make sure that it was content protected and uh, it was um, stripping it. So I connected my same phone, the uh, Galaxy S21 Ultra, to um, through here, through the... Um, Display Link adapter installed the Display Link uh, app on my my Galaxy phone and did not use this this splitter. I did not use it, and I just went from phone to this adapter into the TV, and uh, it would not play this. Um, it was just black, um, black on this screen, and then yeah, it would show it on that screen, but not on this one. So. So yeah, as soon as I get the uh, the HDMI cables in, I'll connect my Pixel phone, Pixel 3 phone to this uh, display link adapter and the monitor, and then I'll, I'll do a video on that for you guys. So this, uh, this Chicken People uh, video is not 4K. So when I try to play a 4K video, it crashes. It actually like crashes my phone. Uh, not all the time, but uh, most of the time. So I will do that. I'll go to a 4K video here. Um, let's see. What's, I don't know. Whatever. Reacher. I'll just go to Reacher here. And then um, we'll play this. Is this 4 Yeah. So you can see. I don't know if you can see it actually, but yeah, you should be able to see that. It says 4K Ultra HD. Um, so when I go to play this, uh, or any kind of 4k content on Amazon Prime uh, What happens is it crashes it because this cable here this USB-C 
to uh, HDMI cable that connects between my phone, between the phone and this uh, splitter. It's an old one, and it, it does not have the ability to do that. So that's my only, that's my conclusion to why this happens. But um, yeah, so we'll play this, and then uh, you guys can see what happens here. Screen goes black. You can still see well the mouse cursor, but the mouse isn't moving. Phone, yeah, it crashes. Completely just shut down. So yeah, these cables are something yeah, pretty necessary. So I'll just leave it alone and it'll try to restart on its own here in a second. And there it goes. So you can see it's trying to boot back up. So I will uh, I'll just pull that cable out of there, let it reboot, but yeah, just so you know, if you're using an old cable and it crashes, that's why. So anyway, I um, hope this helps. You guys take care. Bye.